Spring is here and how great has this weather been? Plenty of sunshine, cool evenings and even a little bit of rain. But we can't get too complacent. Summer will be here before we know it and now is the time to get your gardens summer ready. To help out, I'm going to share with you my top five tips to help you save plenty of water in your gardens right through the summer months. Tip number one, apply a wetting agent. Act now. Don't wait for your lawns or garden to show signs of stress or dehydration first. A top quality wetting agent, either liquid or granule, applied in spring can help ensure your plants and lawns are ready for the arrival of the hot, dry weather. And always remember to water in well after application. My second tip is to plant local, native, endemic plants in your garden. This is another great way to cut back on the amount of water you need to use in your garden. Local, native plants are naturally suited to our hot, dry climate and will thrive with far less water than other plants. And as an added bonus, they're also beautiful plants and will attract native birds and insects into your garden. Tip number three is mulching. It's a simple, easy and economical way to improve the water efficiency levels of any garden. Use a coarse, chunky mulch that will allow any rain or irrigation water to easily pass through it and move into the soil below where it's needed. Apply approximately 70 millimetres thick and remember, keep clear of your plant stems. My fourth water-wise tip is that if you still have one of these old-fashioned cumbersome irrigation controllers, now is a perfect time to say goodbye to old technology and welcome a modern, brilliantly designed smart controller into your life. Smart controllers are connected to your home Wi-Fi and are able to harvest massive amounts of weather data from the internet to automatically modify your program runtimes to save water and keep your garden looking great. They are so easy to use and are able to be accessed remotely. Brilliant. Lastly, but certainly not least, I implore you to plant more trees. Shady gardens are cooler, healthier and use less water to keep the plants and lawns in tip-top condition. Shade-giving trees lower the evaporation rate in the garden, therefore less moisture is lost from the soil, so your plants won't get anywhere near as heat-stressed. Cool shady gardens are also fantastic news for their gardeners. Well, there you go. Five pretty cool tips to help keep your garden in great condition right through summer and to help you save a fair bit of water. Best of luck and I hope you enjoy your summer.